So let's practice. All these are written in scientific notation. See the first digit is less, it's nine or less, but more than one. So they're all written in scientific notation. How do we write them in standard form, standard notation? Well, remember the exponent tells you. It says positive two. So we wanna move forward two places with the decimal. And so the next decimal takes this new place. So it becomes 325. All right, on this one, it says five places forward. So there's only one digit here. So what do we do? Yes, we annex zeros. So we do seven. And I like to start counting the eight as one until I get to five. So I go one, two, three, four, five. And that's my standard number. 780,000. This is a one. It tells me move the decimal one place forward because the one is positive. So that's five, eight. And now we come down to the bottom. This is a negative two. So it tells me take the decimal place two places backward. One, two. Remember annex zeros where there is no digit. So count again, one, two, and rewrite all the whole numbers. Don't forget to rewrite the whole numbers. This is a negative four. So what does that tell us to do? Yes, move four places back. That's one, two, three, four. And that's where the new decimal goes. So I'm gonna put a zero for no whole numbers, put the decimal, and then I'm gonna be, begin to count. Zero, 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 four. One, two, three, and the four goes there. And don't forget to write all the whole numbers back. Let's, let's do an exercise with a calculator now. We're gonna pull the calculator up and we're gonna do these in the calculator. So we're going to do in the calculator, 3.25 times 10 to the two. Remember this x to the y is the exponent button. So let's go. 3.25 times 10 raised to the second power equals, see that? 325, 325. Let's do the negative one. It's 2.47 times 10 to the negative two. Now on my phone calculator, this button is not there. I use this negative button instead for the negative two. And that's what you need to get used to the calculator you're using even for the SOLs because they're all different. I struggled to figure out how to write a negative two and I had to practice and made so many errors. So this is the change, the, the, the into the change button for negative or positive. It's a plus with a line in between and negative. So let's do it. 2.47 times 10 raised, ooh, how do you do this? Not use negative two to the two negative, yes, that's it, equals, and you see that, 0 0.0247, 0 0.0247.
So that's how we go from scientific to STEM. 